Good morning. Check out this weekend comparison. Let's think back to last Sunday. 82 degrees, right? Sunny, warm. Today, we're going to be lucky if we get to about 60 degrees. We have the soggy, cool conditions. What a change, and especially from this past week when we had 80s and even a 90, our first 90 of the year. The reason being, we have easterly flow, we have rain, we have clouds, and that is keeping us very cool this weekend. Yesterday, we only hit 54 for the high in Harrisburg. Today we could do a little bit better. Our News 8 Storm Team forecast calls for steady light rain this morning, gloomy conditions, temperatures in the low 50s. Rain will taper to showers and drizzle this afternoon, so it eases a little bit. There'll still be a light easterly, southeasterly breeze, and that southeasterly component could get us up to about 60 for our high today. But drizzly, cool this evening, still damp out there. Tonight, cloudy skies, temperatures hold steady in the upper 50s, and we still have some pockets of drizzle around. Tomorrow's going to be cloudy to start, but you'll notice in the afternoon it feels a lot warmer. We'll get into the 70s for our highs, and there's only a slim chance of rain, an isolated shower or thunderstorm as a cold front drops in. But that front's not really going to cool us off. It's going to come right back north as a warm front midweek. We're going to pop into the 80s by Wednesday. Looking back at yesterday, we had 54 for our high, not even the mid 50s in Harrisburg. 71 is average. Record was 91 degrees yesterday, and rainfall before midnight was around 3 tenths but we picked up more since then. So most spots right now are ranging from a half inch to three quarters of an inch of rain. That just sets the stage, doesn't it? That's our Lancaster sky cam showing raindrops all over the lens. It's 52 currently in Lancaster. We have 52 in Lebanon. Good morning, Gettysburg. You have a pair of fives there and 52 degrees currently in Carlisle. So this easterly wind coming right in off the cool ocean. Ocean water temperature is about 50 degrees. So what you see is what you get. That's what we have right now. Those low 50s, the clouds, the drizzle, and the rain. High pressure, though, is stationed right over Nova Scotia and clockwise flow around the high, driving in that easterly wind yesterday and today. Now we do have brighter skies a little bit as we head into the week ahead, but it's still going to be a little bit unsettled. I'll show you in a second. Today, here we are at lunchtime. We have the rain still around. This evening, it looks like the predictor is getting rid of the rain, but I still think there will be some drizzle lingering. Same deal tonight, some patchy drizzle, areas of drizzle into tomorrow morning. Here comes this cold front. It's really just a boundary. It's going to focus a small chance of a shower or thunderstorm over us tomorrow. Low pressure then crosses by tomorrow night into Tuesday morning, and there could be a couple of additional showers Tuesday afternoon. Now here comes this warm front. This lifts north on Wednesday, and that's going to pop us right back into the 80s with still slim chances for rain. There's a daily chance, but nothing like we saw this past weekend. So here we go. Uh, your predictor estimated rain fall totals on top of what you already got. These are coming down as the rain starts to drift off just a little bit. I think the heaviest is now east of us, but you could still pick up a few more tenths of an inch. If you're going out to lunch or dinner for Cinco de Mayo today, even breakfast, looking good. Temperatures will be in the 50s there. You just have to dodge those raindrops, right? Indoor activities today. So here's the 10 day forecast. We have 76 for you tomorrow, 76 on Tuesday, 84. There it is on Wednesday. Back to the 70s on Thursday and behind a cold front that comes through on Thursday, that should kick us into the 60s for the upcoming Mother's Day weekend. So we have plenty of time to fine tune that forecast. I know you see, uh, you know, the clouds and the rain every day and you think it's going to be a washout. But honestly, Jay, I can't pin any day after today as a washout in that 10 day forecast. It's hard.